I have a few rhetorical questions. Why does everything have your name on it? And why must you talk about yourself continuously? I said continuously. <laughs> have you ever considered sharing the spotlight just a little bit with dot dot dot? I don't know dot dot dot. Maybe our Lord and Savior and Savior and Savior. <laughs> Yeah. Love, Misty. Yeah, I like the love and the end is always great. Or love. in his grip. You know, that's yeah. always a fun way to end those in his things. Grip. <laughs> <laughs> Nicely so that, done. That was good. That yeah. felt good. I, I wish that was the only uh, one that I had of people yeah, that hate me. But I'm looking at the sheet. It's quite lengthy. Yeah, we might not have time for all of them. Let's just do two more. Okay, all right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. I'm going to go down to D for this one. Fantastic. I don't know why. Just Drop right. D. With all due respect, I'm writing to complain. Dot 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 again. <laughs> I know you are a talk show host and not necessarily a preacher or theologian, but I think we all have a responsibility to impart. Biblical truth, and I was disappointed that, comma, that didn't happen. <laughs> I remember this email. It was I do remember this email because I refuse to like hate on someone for sinning. And there, there's a whole other part of that email that's like sinners must know they're sinning. Uh, yeah, I probably should have added that in Wait, there too. I, I wasn't done yet. Oh, sorry. Love, George. <laughs> All uh, right, you got another one in you? I got one more. <laughs> this one feels kind of like a worship anthem. Oh, it's a worship email? Yeah, a worship for, hate mail? How many listeners you got? You got thousands. thousand. Two. Right? Two? Okay. I, I had three before this one, <laughs> and the guy bailed. <laughs> it goes like this. It's, n <laughs> this is the it's not out of hate that I'm writing. It's just so that you could mature and actually learn faith, learn real faith, <laughs> learn real faith. I wish I could buy the station and fly a Wally. <laughs> Sing with me. I wish I could buy the station and fire Wally. For the record, anyone that sings with him oh, is fired. I see <laughs> that I bought the station just to fire Wally. <laughs> Come on, sing it, sing like it you out. Mean it. Well, I wish I, I could, could buy the station. station. Yes, I bought the station by a wall. <laughs> <laughs> That's so beautiful. I almost want to fire myself. <laughs> that is oh, awesome. Mr. Matthew West. And gentlemen. Knocking that out of the park there. Wally knocking just, it out of the park. Just a musical insight into my email box every day. <laughs> oh, man. I literally am almost peeing my pants. That was... <laughs> That was so much fun. I want to read more of your emails. Please let me do that. I will do that. You could be our new hate mail, oh. uh, 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 like minstrel. Why don't we? Sh I'll share you email. We'll trade emails because okay. I get some hate mail. Oh, because I, I play ukulele. I could put a couple of years to ukulele. Dude. You do you have any uh, emails that you would like to make an impromptu song up about yourself? Oh man, because I get some you know hate mail. Sometimes. Who would hate on you, man? You know, some people like it, basically. Sometimes you just can't win for losing. That's true. You know what I mean? It's like, um, okay, so we home we homeschool our daughters. Um, they sacrifice so much to be out on the road with me. You Which know? is great as a dad to be able to Man, take your kids with you on the road. It's we awesome. love it. My wife's MVP of our family. So they're doing schoolwork on the bus, but they don't get to see their friends like they normally do. So we try to make the trips really special, right? You know, But we, we're as a family, we're spending our whole life telling the world about Jesus. You know, that's, yeah. We're on the road, and, and we love it. But there are sacrifices. So Easter was coming around, and our bus driver, 
um, did this really sweet thing just for the kids to make them smile that day. He had gone and gotten all these crafts, and we have a white tour bus that we're traveling on on this tour, and he made the windshield look like the face of a bunny. That's awesome. And then at the on the back of the bus, he got one of these fluffy white decorations to make it look like a tail. So our bus looked like the Easter Bunny. Yeah, how fun is that? Fun, if you're a right? kid, that's awesome. So I posted a picture. I made the mistake of First posting mistake. a picture saying, <laughs> saying the West family's all ready for Easter. <laughs> At which point I began to lose fans uh, by the tens as they began to criticize. Yet eating a chocolate cross doesn't bother anyone. <laughs> like I, I don't understand <laughs> that. <laughs> so we're eating the head off of a harmless <laughs> bunny, I mean, that, but people began to, you know, so I'll sing one of my hate. I'll, oh, I'll fantastic. Sing, I'll combine a few of the hate messages. Oh, fantastic. From okay. Easter. This is okay. awesome. So this is Matthew West's uh, musical yeah. hate mail. I gotta say, Matthew, I'm so disappointed <laughs> that you would celebrate such a pagan ritual. Oh, he's not even reading this. He has it in, to, oh, committed to memory. Oh, I read it many times because <laughs> I thought about responding many times. As a Christian artist with a public platform, you should think about that more often. The Easter's about the cross, not about a bunny. <laughs> and let me ask you this. Did a bunny ever rise from the dead? The answer is no, no, no. no Did no. a bunny ever rise from the dead? The answer is no, no, no. 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 I'm not your fan anymore. Because you celebrate pagan ritual holidays with bunnies. <laughs>